struck the board and cried, No more! I went abroad! What? Shall I ever sigh and pine? My lines in life are free, free as the road, loose as the wind, as large as storm. Shall I be still in suit? Have I no harvest but a thorn to let me blood and not restore? What I've lost with cordial fruit? Sure, there was wine before my sighs did dry it. There was corn before my tears did drown it. Is the year only lost to me? Have I no base to crown it? No flowers, no garlands gay? All blasted, all wasted? Not so, my heart, but there is fruit. And thou hast hands. Recover all thy sigh-blown age on double pleasure. Leave thy cold dispute of what is fit and not. Forsake thy cage, thy ropes of sand, which petty thoughts have made and made to thee. Good cable to enforce and draw and be thy law. While thou didst wink and wouldst not see, Away, take heed, I will abroad. Call in thy death's heed there, tie up thy fears. He that forbears to suit and serve his need deserves his load. But as I raved and grew more fierce and wild at every word, methought I heard one calling, Child! And I replied, My lord! So the first uh, pair of brackets, he talks about how he rejects his belief of God. And then the second pair of brackets, he describes how he's trying to convince himself to go back to the church and just be a part of it, even though he hates it there. And then the third pair of brackets, he's trying to come back to his faith and understand his, understand why he's trying to leave the church. Um, the fourth pair of brackets, it's the voice of God going through him, and he's talking about how he needs to seize the day. And then the f last pair of brackets, he talks about how he has he submitted back to God by listening to him call him child and he replying back to him by saying, my Lord. So the emotions he's feeling is, let's first start off with the title. A collar means restriction, it's like a dog collar. And then it also says struck and cried, which means those two emotions together represent frustration. And then he also questions himself saying, have I no harvest but a thorn? So basically what he's saying is, have I no reward except pain for being part of the church? And then of course down here where he's where God is talking through him. This is where he feels he needs to seize the day, basically carpe diem. And the green represents um, his purpose, so why he's writing this poem. So I will abroad means he will leave. Basically he will leave the church. Um, shall I be in suit? Um, the suit he is talking about is a priest suit, so this man is obviously a part of the church if he is talking about a suit. And then it says, have I no harvest but a thorn, so his purpose again is have I no reward except for pain. So with what I have lost with cordial fruit, sure there was wine, before my sighs did dry it, there was corn before my tears did drown it. He's basically saying here that yes, he believes in God, but there was still nothing there for him. So again, his purpose is saying nothing there for him in the church. And then down here, oh, double pleasures leave thy cold dispute. He's basically saying by being in the church, he had to give up his pleasures of the world because he was restricted again to do only doing certain things and then again he said he will leave with I will abroad then highlighted in blue we have repetition so again in the beginning of the poem we have I will abroad and at the end of the poem he says he's gonna leave again 
And also, slightly here in the middle of the poem, he says, I ha um, have I no bays to crown it, no flowers, no garlands gay, all blasted? Basically saying he's like, okay, again, he has no reward for being in the church. So we use Ciardi, so we're gonna say, the questions we asked was who is speaking? So the speaker is the author. And to whom he's speaking? He's talking to God. And the situation he is in is he wants to leave the church in order to experience the pleasures of the world. So the attitude of the speaker is frustrated because he is being restricted to the church. The reader can see this from their conclusion. Sorry. <laughs> Based on the lines, I have no harvest but a thorn, because he, all his reward is pain from the church. So he, you can see that he's frustrated and restricted to just the church. And then the knowledge that we gained from knowing this is that everyone has their own struggles and doesn't matter the situation they are in but a lot of people go through what he went through with his restrictions to God.